Hi, Cass. Hi, Darian. Happy Monday. Um, my dumbass keeps forgetting it's a damn-ass Monday, but today I remembered, so I decided I had to say something, so I made a video. Here I am. Um, I only have a couple things to cover. This will probably be a pretty short video because I don't really have anything to talk about. I don't We're so bad at this vlogging thing, but I really want it to work out, so we'll see how that goes. Anyways, one, check out this fabulous ass piece of art that I call my hair. It's nice, it's red, appealing to my, like, desire to have abnormally colored hair without me dyeing my hair electric blue again. Two, uh, as you probably know, Cass's phone committed suicide while she was in Vegas. And then her laptop also decided that it was its time. Um, so that's why she hasn't made any videos or anything. Um, both of those problems are fixed now, so she should have a video up on Wednesday. I'm hoping I'm counting on her. I'm probably going to yell at her to remind her. That's basically the new news. Uh, tiny peek into my life because I'm sure you're, like, dying to hear it. Um, I started my senior year two weeks ago. Uh, so far, I really, really am enjoying myself this year. It's, it really is the year that's like, we're sorry for making your life a living hell while you were a junior. Here, don't have any work, and I only have to be at school for four hours, and then I get to leave. Like, today, I left school at 12.15, and I went to damn-ass Taco Bell. That's just, it's just great, and I have no homework. I, I came home, and I watched the new episode of Breaking Bad, which, by the way, whoo. That was pretty intense. And I worked out, which is why I look so obviously fabulous. I'm a dancer now. I'm taking a dance class. I kind of decided that even though I am not planning on changing my eating habits because I like my food and I don't necessarily, I don't really have a desire to be like skinny. I mean like good for people who are and I think that it's awesome and I, I mean I think that like people of all sizes are beautiful but like I don't really want to be skinny. It's just, it's never been the way I am. I've never been skinny, and I'm kind of used to it by now, and I kind of like having a little bit extra on me. Like, I'm okay with it, and I'm comfortable with it. I'm comfortable with myself now. I just think that, like, a lot of things would be easier for me if I were more in shape. So, I'm taking dance now, and uh, I've already lost like five pounds taking this dance class, and I've only been in for like two weeks, and we've only actually been doing things for like a week, week and a half. But yeah, that's a little bit into my life. Uh, so then I figured for the rest of this video, I'd just talk about music a little bit, because when all else fails, I tend to talk about either music or politics, but I know better than to open my mouth on politics here, because then this video would end up being like 20 minutes about feminism. I'm a woman, strong and independent. I don't answer to no one, except for, like, my mom, but, you know, music. Um, couple songs I'm obsessed with right now. One, Echo by Incubus. Um, I'm obsessed with Incubus overall as a band right now, but, um, I downloaded, like, their entire discography, like, two weeks ago or something, like, right when I started school, I downloaded their whole discography. And Echo is one song that, like, really stuck. It's really calm, really, like, chill. Um, but it's such, such a beautiful song. And it's, like, a mild love song, but it's not, like, I love you, <laughs> like, super cheesy shit that nobody wants to hear. And I guess you could call it more, like, sentimental. Um, so yeah, really, really, really good song. I would definitely recommend it to both of you because I think that both of you would like it. Two, obviously, even though it's been on the radio and it's overplayed like hell, it's not overplayed in my heart because I'm still feeling the feels that all this happened. Get Lucky by Daft Punk. Um, I listened to Daft Punk before it was cool, no big deal or anything. But um, yeah, I just like, Daft Punk has always like had quite the presence in the electronic music industry, but they've never been so successful as they are right now. And it just, like, it honestly makes me, like, almost emotional, like, thinking about, like, how much they've grown, how much electronic music has grown overall, 
like, in, like, the past, like, five years, especially, like, electronic music has just evolved, and it's become such a huge part of music now. It was something that was practically unheard of before, and now you hear electronic music everywhere. It's, like, there's so many DJ collabs now, and it's played everywhere. It's in movie previews. It's in famous, like, rock artist albums are including DJs, and it's just, like, it's all so great. Um, and I'm re just really proud that Daft Punk has made it this far, and that Daft Punk is just such a commonly recognized name now that lots of people may not have really heard of them before. Like, nobody really knows any other songs except for, like, Get Lucky, Harder, Better, Faster, Stronger, Technologic. But... Still, they're getting somewhere. Uh, so yeah. Daft Punk. Number three. My third song would probably be Give Me Love by Ed Sheeran. Um, I tried not to fall onto the Ed Sheeran bandwagon because it was mostly Tumblr girls being like, Oh my god, Ed Sheeran, he's British and he makes sad acoustic music. And I was just like, oh god, barfs all over computer. But, um... You know, I ended up becoming one of those people. So yeah, he's just, he he really does make good music, and he's just, he's just really talented. <laughs> Ed Sheeran's just great. Um, Give Me Love is probably my favorite song by him, and the music video is really awesome. Uh, and Ed Sheeran overall, he just, he's, he's a pretty cool guy. And, fun fact, his first concert ever was a Green Day concert. So... You know, obviously that's like automatic, like, brownie points in my book. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much what I had to talk about today. So, Cass, I will hopefully see you on Wednesday. I'm going to totally crawl up your ass about making a video. And Darian, I will see you on Friday.